Myocardial infarction, or heart attack, is the leading cause of death in the developed world. It refers to death of the myocardial or heart muscle tissue due to an imbalance between the supply and the demand of oxygen. Heart is the organ that pumps blood throughout the body to supply oxygen and nutrients to all the organs and tissues in the body. To do so, heart also requires an adequate blood supply. Heart is supplied by the first pair of arteries to originate from the aorta, the right and left coronary arteries. These arteries branch out to form an arterial network around the heart muscle, called the coronary circulation. A heart attack occurs when the blood supply to the heart muscle is compromised due to impaired blood flow through the coronary circulation, leading to death of a part of the heart muscle. Atherosclerosis, or formation of lipid plaques in the coronary arteries or their branches, is by far the most common cause of heart attack. When an artery is partially occluded by an atherosclerotic plaque, it causes turbulence in the blood flow through the affected artery, causing damage to the endothelial lining of the artery at the site of the plaque. This will lead to formation of a blood clot at the affected site, causing complete obstruction to the blood flow and compromising tissue perfusion. Other less common causes of heart attack include coronary artery spasms, coronary artery embolism, coronary arteritis, anemia, low blood pressure, and cardiac hypertrophy. The most common and concerning symptom of myocardial infarction is chest pain, which is typically felt behind the sternum and often radiates up to the neck, shoulders, and jaws and down the left arm. The pain is often described as squeezing or applying a pressure on the chest and it usually lasts for about 30 to 60 minutes. However, some patients describe it as a burning type of pain, mainly in the epigastric region, with a sensation of abdominal fullness. Interestingly, some patients do not experience chest pain, especially when they are having a high pain threshold or an illness like diabetes mellitus. Most often patients experience chest pain during the early morning hours when the sympathetic tone of the body is at a higher level. Other symptoms of myocardial infarction include the following. Prodromal symptoms before the onset of chest pain, including fatigue, chest discomfort or malaise. Anxiety, commonly described as a sense of impending doom. Lightheadedness and sometimes syncope. Cough, extreme sweating. Nausea and sometimes vomiting. Shortness of breath, wheezing, and abdominal fullness. On physical examination, Patients will have an increased heart rate, blood pressure, and respiratory rate with elevated temperature.